situation. So let's see if that is indeed on right here. Two strike bunt attempt here as this one's down. Throw won't get him. Well, he took a risk with the decision to throw to second instead of taking the sure out at first. Not sure if someone was yelling for him to go to second, but we know now it was the wrong call. And the they'll side. need him to get something the going baseman. here. Ben Black. Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. Line towards center field. Marte has to roam straight back, but he... it for the first out jumped all over that first pitch of the inning and he didn't miss it just wasn't able to steer it in a direction that resulted in a leadoff hit and he didn't miss it just wasn't able to steer it in a direction that resulted in a leadoff hit Ben Black. It's been an 0 for 2 effort for him to this point. What? First offering on its way. Line to the right side. But a little unlucky there as it's hit right to him in right field for the final out of the inning. A man left for the White Sox. They're down 2-1. Now we're going to have a conference at the home plate area, so it would appear that we'll see a double switch here. Ladies Kelvin Herrera gets the call from please. the pen to take over He's on the mound and start the, the home side. seventh. Now pitching and batting in the eighth spot, number 41, Kelvin Herrera. Now playing third base and batting nine, number 20. Jose Rondon. Let's play ball. Three. Out. Three to two to finish in tonight's game. The Diamondbacks came through late, taking the lead in the eighth to secure the victory. 
Johnny Knapp earns the victory on the mound. So that just about does it for Mark DeRosa, Dan Plezak, Heidi Watney, and our entire crew. I'm Matt Vaskersian. You've been watching MLB The Show. For more, make your way over to theshownation.com. Not a lot of fireworks, but that narrows the candidate list for our top player of the game. And the man you the see... Final line. There is rain in the area, but we've been given the go-ahead to get this one started. Today, spring training action from the Cactus League between the Chicago White Sox and the Arizona Diamondbacks. Play ball. Three. Standing in, Ben Black. He'll get to take his first cuts here. Ben Black. From the stretch, here's the pitch. Hit sharply on the ground. And that's through for a hit. Marte fields it cleanly. Not a way to find the sweet spot. Yeah, right that's there. a pitch right there to split finger that needs to be buried, and it was not executed. Left it thigh high, and as an offensive player, that's what you're waiting on. So stepping in, Carlos Rodon, as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. A one-two pitch. Bit of a surprise here as he's going to try to lay one down. And you can't ask for much more out of a pitcher than that. The sacrifice works to perfection. Stepping in and ready for another shot, Edgar Ruiz, as he's got a chance to tie this ball game up with that equalizing run just 90 feet away at third. Now the three and two pitch is a swing and a miss. That's strike three. Wow, that's awfully impressive right there. The pitch before was really close. Called the ball. What does he do? He comes back with a better pitch and gets the punch out. Two men on, two out, and into bat. The Next, right the left-handed hitting Lonnie Chisenhall. Lonnie Chisenhall. This is hit Come the on, other way on, on towards left field. Go on. Peralta is there, and he puts this one away for the third out. So a great job there of working out a potential trouble. So it's no runs on two hits, no errors, and two men left stranded. We'll head now to the home half of inning number three. Arizona's on top, one to nothing. chance Ben Black he reached on a the single in his base. first try ben. yeah and they take another Black. single right here that third base coach is dying to wave his arms I wouldn't be surprised if anything hit hard through the infield he's gonna wave him mm, fooled him with that one as he's oh, way man. out in front from a hitter's perspective you knocked a donut off your bat knowing two things this pitcher is out on the mound looking for a strikeout or a double play so you better set your sights at least belt high wow. Hit. Here's a fastball at the knees. Good spot, good <clears throat> pitch, and it's 0-2. And, Fly ball out to straightaway right. Souza is under it, one down. And the runner, not tagging, will retreat to second base. Riding into the box, Ben Black. He flew out in his last at bat. Here comes the first pitch. Big swing, but he just gets a piece of it. Strike one. One run, six hits, and no errors so far for the White Sox. Lined is short, but gobbled up there, and there are two away. What's the play ball? So the lineup flips over and digging in Tim LoCastro. The second baseman, Tim LoCastro. Pitch is popped up. Black shading to his right. 
No trouble with this one, and the inning is over. So one, two, three. a close one here but this man was a big factor in the outcome so we're inclined to pencil him in as the top player of the game the final line's multi-hit game and shape man shape my contact drop Shit. Uh oh. MLB Network's coverage of Major League Baseball is on the air. Opening day is here as we get the new season underway with a good matchup between the Chicago White Sox and the Kansas City Royals. Hello again, everybody. Baseball is back. Welcome to our special opening day broadcast on MLB Network. I'm joined by Dan Plezak. And Dan, as we get things going this season, it's pitching that has to be key if this team's going to have success. Just like any team, pitching is going to be a key factor for this ball club as the year plays out. I'm sure the staff will have its ups and downs, but if they can pitch like they can, I think this team is going to be pretty successful. The games count starting now. Opening day on MLB Network, and it's coming up next.
Getting close to first pitch here. Let's listen in to public address announcer Alex Miniak. And now, your 2020 Kansas City Royals. Now a moment here to check out the White Sox starting lineup. Mark, what do you have on this lineup as they go for their first win? Matty, you take a look at this lineup. I find myself thinking back to my playing days when I knew I had the ace on the mound. It had to be win day, and when you get in the car to drive <coughs> to the yard, you tell yourself, even though you felt bad about it, just get two or three. All the pressure's on the big boy to have to execute, and he usually does. Look for this. I, wow, first hit in the majors. Tiger Woods, that's why I picked that bat. That's why I picked that bat. Tiger Woods, baby. Damn. Beautiful, man. It's beautiful. Here comes the first pitch. Hit hard to Let's third. Go, come on, come on, come on. And just past his outstretched glove into left, a base oh, hit. Hey, way to screw that thing up, man. And there's probably no happier person in the ballpark. Ben oh. Black has just collected his first hit in the big leagues. And as is customary, there's the ball being sent into the dugout. Someone will tuck it away for him to put in his trophy case. Yeah, good for him, and congratulations. Listen, he's worked his entire lifetime for this moment, and he's obviously trying to play cool right now, but you can bet inside his head, he's on top of the world. Batting done. So stepping in, base. Yomer Sanchez, Carlos. as he'll look to bring home that tying run from second with a base hit into the outfield. Hold up, This hold one's up. down to dig, third. Dig, dig, run it up, run it up. Oh, but it's thrown away at second. Ah. Two out front will not come to pass as the inning is over. White Sox right. strand a couple. They're on the short end of a. That's embarrassing. Here's the catcher, Salvador Perez. His career line against catcher. Garrett Cole. He's a 318 hitter. He all one home run. Reined in. On to first, and the Royals can't cash in as the inning is over. Royals strand a pair, but they lead it one to nothing. At the plate, Ben Black. He singled his last time up. What? Ready with the first pitch. Here it comes. A swing and a shot hit down the corner. And that nearly would have gotten him on the board. Instead, it's a long foul ball. Line hard toward right center. In there, a base hit. No mistake what he was sitting on. Looking for a dead red piece of cheese middle of the plate, and he didn't miss it. Standing in, Yomer Sanchez. The batter number five, second baseman, Carlos Sanchez. Comes set, the 0-1. Drops one All down right, here, up. and he'll try he's to up. beat it out. And he'll step oh. on the bag himself, and the inning is over. as they'll look to get something going here and even this game up. Yeah. Even though we're moving what? into the back end of this game, they're only down by a couple of runs. You know that old slogan, a bloop and a blast. They could certainly use that right now. Line drive to center field. Almora is there, and he has it for the first down. Jumped all over that first pitch of the inning, and he didn't miss it. Just wasn't able to steer it in a direction.
that resulted. In a leadoff hit. Play ball. Ready once again, Ben Black. First pitch coming, here it is. Hot shot down the line. Oh, and this is past him down the line. A fair ball. Thought about going for second, but instead, now they've got him in a pickle. And he'll try to get back now, but it's not going to work. The throw hangs him out to dry, and that'll end the inning. So it's two runs on three hits, no errors, and a runner left on. Home half of the eighth straight ahead. KC leads this one 5-2. to two. First of the year, Garrett Cole pitched well, allowing only two earned, but ends Our up taking the loss. This afternoon, first for the victorious Kansas City Royals. MLB The Show has Saturday Night Baseball from Kauffman Stadium in Kansas City, Missouri. Tonight, game. Jake Junis, a right-hander from Illinois, will be the starter here. Stepping up to the plate, Ben Black, as he'll get his first opportunity in this one. Ready to deliver, here's the first pitch. Oh, and he hung the slider here, and it's a towering drive out to deep left field. This ball is gone, a home run. So that's his first home run in the big leagues, and it's fair to say it's a moment he'll never forget. Well, there's no doubt about that, Matt. People ask him 50 years from now who he hit it off of and what stadium he was playing in, and he'll remember it all. Heck, he'll probably remember what kind of pitch it was, too. Hopefully he can get the ball back so that can go in his trophy case forever. in his first at bat we'll see what he's got in store for us here one of the keys to securing a win they want to keep the pressure on and try to build that lead as much as they can moving into the later innings Play ball. in one for two with yeah. that home run he hit wow. earlier. First offering on its way. And he throws the fastball by him here. 0 and 1. The way this guy at the plate gets down the line, contact is your friend in this situation. Tough to double him up. This middle infield has got to do their best to roll it as quick as possible. Hit down the line at first. Moncada, the runner at third. Morrison on second. McCann is over at first with one away. This is lifted into the air out towards center field. Almora in pursuit. He makes the catch. Here comes the runner from third. And they'll extend their lead even further as the run from third is in to score. Obviously, he's hoping for... He's out! Stepping in, Ben Black comes in one for two with that home run he hit earlier. He comes set. Here's the nothing and nothing pitch. Driven nicely into the gap. 
Score! Score! And Come this on, is going to rattle up against the out-of-town scoreboard now. Now it's cut off. A throw to the plate. Top of the throw will be well up the line as he scores easily. I mean, that had to feel good right there, Dan. That's his third RBI of the game and extends his team's lead. They might have this one locked up. Oh, I tell you, those are always big, those add-on insurance runs. Big RBI right there for a little bit more breathing room. And he's safe. So the batting order turns over now and set to go Edgar Ruiz. Two Edgar. outs and two runners aboard Ruiz. here in the seventh inning. The 2-2 freezes hey. him. A strikeout looking. So it's two runs on... Digging in and looking for more, Ben Black. He'll try to follow up the double in his last at-bat with another big hit right here. Yeah, he jumped all over that first pitch last time up. Interested to see if he has the same approach this A.B. On to first, and they turn the double play. Play ball. Digging in, William Gironco. No hits in three tries so far. He struck out once. Bouncer to the left side, right to him. Throw on to first is going to take care of him as the Royals are now down to their last chance now. And this evening's ends at a 7-2 finish. The Palos took the lead in the second inning and rode that until the very end. Carlos Radon.